Hello and welcome back. I am Brian. You are Chords and Notes Nation. This is Dimas. It's going to cover Beat It by Michael Jackson. It says it's an acoustic cover. So, six months ago he did this. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's give this a shot. I'm excited. I, Hey, it's been, it's been a, a while since I've covered, uh, well, no, I covered a Michael Jackson song not too long ago, but there was a lot of time in between, uh, but this is a cover. So we'll see what Dimas can do with this, see how he can uh, vocally stand up in comparison to MJ. Do I want to say comparison? Let's just see what he can do. Okay. Anyways, if you guys are new here, please subscribe, please like, that will grow the channel, cost you nothing, just click of a button. If you want to go above and beyond, super thanks. Donation requests go through PayPal, description box below. And if you want to become an official member of Chords and Notes Nation Experience, all things Chords and Notes, and get priority on everything, Patreon. That information is in the description box below. Let's go. a dancer.
get out of here. Beat it. Scram. Okay, yeah. Um, so what an iconic song from, obviously, the king of pop. Uh, an icon there. And that was a very um, bold move to to want to go up against that and and do his best to cover that song. And I think he did a really nice job. I think in this song he enunciated um, he enunciated the words very well. Um, in comparison, I would say with uh, "Wind of Change" from Scorpions, uh, his enunciation of certain consonants and vowels weren't as sharp as they were here. So I think he did a really good job with that. Um, and it's I, the recording was wonderful. I enjoyed that. The acoustic, that was a nice touch. Uh, but again, here this is a song, an iconic song, where the guitars are just, a much, just as much an active, aggressive player in the composition and the overall mood of the song as the vocals are. And I don't know if it really worked for me. I think the, his guitarist did a very good job of, of uh, interpreting um, the guitars th through acoustic because there's a huge difference, obviously, between acoustic and electric and what you can do. Um, and this is, no, this is no knock on his guitar player because his guitar player is a very good guitar player. Uh, but it's just one of those songs that I don't necessarily know if I would have... Uh, turned it into an acoustic cover. However, because it was acoustic, acoustic, and the nature of acoustic guitar is a little more subdued than electric. What that did is that brought out his vocals a little bit more and and embellished or made his vocals, vocal tracks shine a little bit better than they would have if it was with a standard rock band, um, guitar, bass, drums, synth. Uh, so the choice of going acoustic on this has a plus or a minus to it. And I think since we're featuring Dimas here and not his band, I think overall it was more of a plus than a minus. Uh, so I've got nothing but high praise for this gentleman. I think he's doing a wonderful job uh, with the gifts that God has given him and surrounding himself with capable musicians to help um, elevate the music and, and his skill set as well so yeah very good i enjoyed it i really did i really did so god bless you guys we're living in extreme times get joshua 1 9 into your mind and into your heart the promises are there for us and uh just remember jesus loves you i'll talk to you later bye